Hi there, my name's Chris, and I'm part of the product team at Obviously AI, the fastest and easiest tool to build AI models in minutes without writing code. Today, we're going to build a model to predict fraudulent transactions in a bank. We'll start by reviewing the dataset, we'll then build a machine learning model for predicting fraud transactions, and instantly see how we can make predictions and share them with others on the team. So, let's get started. In this dataset, every single row is an individual transaction and every column tells us something about that transaction, like type, amount, balance, etc. This tells us if a transaction in that row has been flagged as fraudulent, yes or no. This is a historical dataset, and we now want to use it to predict whether a new transaction is likely to be fraudulent. To build a model, we start by uploading this CSV. We can upload spreadsheets, connect to apps and services like Salesforce and Dropbox, and even databases like MySQL and BigQuery. Once uploaded, all you have to do is select your prediction column, and in this case, it's a fraud column. From here, obviously AI will automatically build a machine learning model to make predictions in less than one minute. Once your model is built, it's ready to be used right away. No deploying and no maintenance. You can see its accuracy and performance details here, and it seems like we're good to go. We start by heading to personas to make a first prediction, and let's say we have a new transaction. This is a cash out transaction, with a total amount of $25,000. As I change these details, I can see the prediction of this transaction come up right here. The transaction has a 92% probability of not being fraudulent. Now, let's head to export predictions, and we can upload a list of new customers and get a prediction on each one. An API can also be used to automate these predictions and embed them in our own app or website. We will also have the option to get a shareable link to send to anyone on your team it will enable them to use the model that you build to start making their own predictions. So, what would you like to predict today?